Hey guys, I've been getting some requests to make some different art supplies, so today we're making a couple of watercolor palettes, a paper pad and a tiny brush. These sets do actually work, so you could bring them as very tiny travel sets, although I don't think you'd be able to make very large pieces with them. Anyway, hope you'll enjoy. I'm going to show you how to make two different types of palettes, so first I roll out a sheet of scrap clay and then cut out the basic shape and size of the palette I wanted. I made another piece in the same size from a thinner sheet of clay and then added a few details on top and this is going to be the lid of one of the palettes. After baking, I pushed both of those into some more scrap clay, then baked those pieces and used them to make a mold. And you can then add some really thin sheets of clay on top of the mold to make one of the palettes. I did record a tutorial for the wooden palette and the tubes of paint you see in the picture, and if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment and then I'll make sure to post the other tutorial together with a few more painting supplies. For the inside I just pre-baked a sheet of clay, cut out some strips and used it to make the small compartments. I attached them using liquid clay and then baked again. To make the hinge part so that the palette can actually open and close, I just poked some holes, tied them together using sewing thread and used liquid clay to strengthen the joints. I then painted the inside using white acrylic paint and the outside using black acrylic paint. The second palette is a lot more simple to make, you just want to roll out a sheet of clay and measure out the size, then take a tool with a flat end and use this to make the compartments. I then pre-baked, wrapped it in some black clay and baked again. And I also used white acrylic paint to paint the inside of this one. For the paint itself I used actual watercolors and the ones I usually use come in pans already so I just went out and bought a really cheap set of the type that comes in tubes. So you just want to add this to the palettes and let it dry. I prefer when art supplies look a bit messy, so I made the palette look kind of used, but if you want a more clean look, you can definitely do that as well. Finally, you just want to seal the outside of the palettes with glaze. For the tiny brush, I just took some bristles from a watercolor brush, 
glued those together and painted the outside using acrylic paint. I also used a tiny bit of silver colored alcohol ink. Finally, for the paper pad, I just took some paper and cut it into equal sized pieces, then added glue to one side and let that dry. And there's your tiny working watercolor set. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next tutorial.